As a priest, I've finally fully realized what I'm supposed to be. Uh, throughout formation, before formation, uh, before I entered the order, as I entered the order, there's always been a sense of, of uneasiness, of incompleteness, of difficulty, of, of hardship in many ways. It, being a Dominican is not easy, being a religious is not easy, uh, training to be a priest is not easy. But after ordination, everything sort of fit together. Uh, everything, is, everything is the way it's supposed to be. And I've never been at, more at ease or more in communion, I think, with God than, than, um, than in my entire life. Uh, it's, it's profound and hard to explain. But I can say that I'm simply closer to God now more than I ever have been in my life, simply with this change. It's, it's one of the most profound things uh, when you become a priest. Immediately, people are very solicitous of, of having confessions heard. Uh, people that are, are, have been away from the sacrament from a, for a long time, they find out you're a new priest, and for some reason they, they, they react to that in a, in a very positive way. It's a, simply the grace of God, I think. Learning to be docile and reliant on the mercy and the grace of others it's a struggle, especially for a young man who's capable in the modern American world. It's humbling, and that aspect of our life is very important to our growth in holiness, I think, and our life in community, and our benefactors, and those who pray for us make all of that possible, make this possible. Uh, without it, we'd not be able to serve God and His church as well as I think we do or can.